Picture this. You've been hurt by someone you love, and every time you think about it, you feel a burning anger inside. The thought of forgiving them feels impossible. But what if I told you that forgiveness is the key to unlocking a better future for your relationship? Today, we're exploring why forgiveness is so hard in relationships and how to overcome the obstacles that stand in the way. Stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to the podcast. Today's topic is a sensitive one, but it's important and it's a conversation that we need to have. We're talking about forgiveness in relationships. So whether it's a romantic relationship, a friendship, or even a family relationship, forgiveness can often be one of the hardest things to do. But why? Why? I'm going to break it down. Here's one reason why. Hurtful experiences. A lot of times the reason why forgiveness is so hard in relationships is because we've been hurt. It could be a betrayal, a lie, even a broken promise. When we've experienced pain, it's only natural that we want to hold on to that anger to protect ourselves from getting hurt again. It's common. Another reason is lack of trust. When someone has hurt us, it can be extremely difficult to trust again. Trust is the crucial part of any relationship. And when it's broken, it can take a lot of time to repair. We've heard the saying, it's easy to lose trust, but it's hard to build it back. Forgiveness usually involves letting go of that anger and extending trust to the person who hurt us, or just letting go of that anger and moving on. I'm going to take a break right here because I want to hear from you. What do you think about what you've heard so far? How do you feel about forgiveness? Head to the comments and let me know how forgiveness has been for you. I know for me, it's been rough. There are things that I'm still working through with forgiveness, but I want you to remember that forgiveness is a journey. It's not a place. It's not a feeling. It's a journey. Let's get back into the episode. So another point I wanted to touch on was emotional attachment. In every relationship, there is a form of emotional attachment. And in many of these relationships, the emotional attachment is deep. This can make it even harder to forgive because forgiving someone really means letting go of your anger and bitterness towards them. And it requires a lot of emotional strength. And that is super challenging. Another reason is the fear of being hurt again. When we've been hurt in our relationships, It's scary to really open up ourselves to that same person again. Forgiveness requires vulnerability and willingness to take a risk. And when you've been hurt, forgiveness seems to be a scary place. And we just don't want to put ourselves back in situations like that again. And finally, my fifth reason why forgiveness is so hard is because we have a desire for justice. Sometimes when people hurt us, we want them to be held accountable for the things they've done. We want them to feel what we feel. We want them to hurt the way we've hurt. But forgiveness can sometimes feel like we're letting them off the hook. And in many cases, most of us don't want to do that. That makes it so hard for us to move forward. Overall, forgiveness is a complicated and emotional process. And it's important to remember that it's not always going to be easy. Everyone's journey with forgiveness is different and unique. And it's okay to take all the time that you need to heal and process all these emotions. I just want you to remember that forgiveness is a powerful tool in repairing relationships and moving forward with time and effort is possible. If you and your significant other right now are struggling with issues or instances of forgiveness, I would love for you to get a copy of my ebook, Love Under Construction. This ebook helps you to rebuild the foundation of your relationship as it pertains to things like finances, communication, commitment, and even forgiveness. If you haven't grabbed your copy yet, there's a link in the show notes right there just for you. Get your copy today. You guys already know I love to keep my episodes short and sweet. Thank you for tuning into today's episode. If you really enjoyed it, please be sure to subscribe and don't forget to hit that bell if you're watching on YouTube so that you don't miss another episode like this one. Take care.